we're on a mission here. This is an extremely rare snake. Costa Rica is home to approximately 139 snake species at this time. But guess what? There was one more snake species to be added and we got it. It was a big surprise. And it all started with a text message from my wife, Kate, who was on a birding trip with our friend, Lori. And they had found a snake. When we all got home, I tried to figure out exactly what it was. To my shock, Kate told me the snake was about a meter long. It was not a tantilla, but what was it? I encouraged her to post on the Costa Rica Snake Identification Facebook page, which she did. Alejandro Solorzano, a foremost authority on snakes in Costa Rica, and has written books and many papers on snakes, chimed in that the snake they found was a pseudoboa and was a new species to Costa Rica in late 2020. And then we got a message. Alejandro asked if we could go back and collect the pseudoboa and preserve it for him. This sent us on a wild adventure. If the snake was an hour away, I had my doubts that it would still be there, but off we went. Since this snake was such a new species to Costa Rica, there was not an actual specimen of a pseudoboa in the Zoology Museum at the University of Costa Rica. According to iNaturalist, the pseudoboa is primarily a South American species that has quietly crept up through Central America to Costa Rica, where there were only two observations that have been made. The Snake ID Costa Rica group and other Facebook groups have recorded several other sightings. We made it back to the place where Lori and Kate saw the snake. And here's what happened next. Trigger warning, deceased snake handling coming up. All right, been, we're on a mission here. This is an extremely rare snake. This is what's called a pseudoboa. This is a roadkill. Uh, only a few have been found in Costa Rica. And uh, Kate, right here, found one with her friend Lori this morning while they were looking for birds here. And we've been asked by the, one of the leading scientists with snakes in Costa Rica to preserve it. So we're going to collect it and take it back and put it in the freezer and then somehow get it to them for the museum as it may be the very first specimen ever found and preserved in Costa Rica. All right, so we've got our Ziploc bag. This guy's not in great shape uh, and he's got a lot of ants but there's not a whole lot we can do about that. Uh, and they're biting ants. Not a very pretty job, but we've got the snake. Now we have to get it to San Jose somehow. <laughs> snake on ice. Not the first time, probably not the last time. We kept it in our freezer until pickup. It was taken from Golfito, to San Jose, where it was prepped for preservation in the Museum of Zoology's permanent collection at the University of Costa Rica. <laughs>